Hey, so this is just going to be a quick little tutorial on how to pack textures for the Arma tools if you don't have or just don't use Substance Painter. Um, so we're going to be using uh, a little program called Easy Channel Packing. It's on Gumroad and it's free. I'll put a link in the description so you don't have to go hunt it down. Um, and basically this will allow us to pack our textures into Arma's format without having a Substance Painter exporter. So once uh, you download that, it'll come in and uh, zip, unzip it, run the exe, this little screen will come up. Uh, you've got packing and unpacking. To start, we are going to unpack because we need to unpack our base color and our normals so we can split up the individual channels to pack it into the tools um, format. So click on unpack. Um, I've got uh, my, you know, my base raw texture maps here, None, no packing done, not even like in the, uh, not even in like an Unreal format. Um, if you do, like for example, if you have a model that was originally packed, like exported for Unreal, and you have like the MRAO, I think they are, uh, packed textures, you can use this to divide them back into metal, roughness, and AO, and then you can use this also to repack said textures into Arma's format. So that would be another case you could, um, or you would want to use a program like this, is if you're converting models from other sources that are already in a different format. Uh, but I'm just gonna show how to do it from raw. So first we gotta split our base color. So let it uh, divide it into our channels here. We're not gonna save the AO because it's just blank, but we are gonna save the red channel, green channel, and blue channel. And then the other map we need to divide up is our normal map. But with our normal map, we only need the R and the G uh, channels because B is um, where our metalness will go when we repack this. Now, I think the way the engine does that is there's like an algorithm or like some basic logic in the code that generates um, the, uh, the B channel. Uh, I probably could do a tutorial on that if people want. It, it's not. It's just kind of like, it's not necessary. It's just, uh, I remember someone told me how that works at one point. Uh, certain engines do that. I think Unity does that with its uh, normals. Um, but anywho, uh, let's save the R and the G channel of our normal. And then we can go back over to the packing and repack these into the proper format. So I'm going to start with our color. And I'm just going to bring our channel red, channel green, channel blue, and then our in our um, AO, or not our AO, our alpha channel, sorry. We're going to put our roughness. So give that a minute to uh, pack up there. Shouldn't take too long. And then after this, we'll do our um, normal metalness and AO. There we go. I'm just going to click pack to make sure it actually packed. It looks like it did, but it's kind of hard to tell because um, the, the having the roughness in the AO, uh, the alpha channel ain't going to change the preview. So then go back here. I'm, I'm just going to call this base underscore packed and do dot PNG because if you don't, for some reason, the program will save it as just a file, which will be blank. Um, if you do save it, to fix that, all you would have to do is rename the file and do .png on the end. But just quicker to do it there. Now we're going to do our normal packing. So we're going to grab our red channel from the normal and our green channel from the normal. And then we're going to... So that there. And then we're going to put metallic in the blue and AO in the alpha. Let that calculate up. And we will have our second and final map ready to be imported into the Arma tools. And there we go. It uh, should be this like kind of yellow. If you've done it correctly, it should be this weird kind of like yellowy color. So I'm going to going to save that and I'm going to call that norm underscore packed dot png and then you'll have both texture maps you need for a basic 
um, for the basic texture workflow of the Arma tools. Right here, you got your base packed and your norm packed. If you want to see how to actually get those in engine and set them up on a model, go to the uh, my texturing video, which is also in the uh, Arma tools playlist. Uh, you, you can't miss it. Um, and that in that I cover how to export with Substance Painter and how to get them in engine. So just skip past the Substance Painter bit and go to the importing the parts. Only a couple of minutes even with the uh, Substance Painter part. Uh, so yeah, uh, that's an alternate way if you don't use Substance Painter. Um, if you have any questions, uh, please let me know uh, and I can uh, answer you as soon as possible. Uh, and I'll see you in the next one. So thanks for watching.